The line graph above shows the monthly rainfall from March to October last year in Chestnut City. According to the graph, what was the greatest change in absolute value in the monthly rainfall between two consecutive months? So don't get too thrown off by the in absolute value portion. It's just saying that we want the greatest change, whether it's an increase or a decrease. We just want to know the absolute value, right? The magnitude of the change. We don't care about the sign. And we want to know what was the greatest change between uh, two consecutive months. And notice all we really need to do is find the first, the month that lead us to the greatest change. And we can see the biggest change is going to be between September and October, just because it's the, the, the farthest drop between months. It drops one, two, three, four, wait, one, two, three, four, five lines, whereas I guess the next biggest change only increases by one, two, three. So this drop of five lines, five units in this axis, is going to be the biggest change. And now let's find out what that big change was. Well, we're starting from five, and we're going to be decreasing all the way to 2.5. So that's a change of 2.5. So that's choice C. To learn more about Reason Prep's SAT, SAT subject test, and ACT video courses, go to reasonprep.com enroll. And you can find the link in the description below the video.